really important to you. Because I find out that we ain't got much time to go here on this on this side. We see things working their self together. We see tribulation coming upon us. It's coming. We hear the rumors of how things are about to come upon the earth. So let me ask you something. What's important to you? Because you're not getting any richer. We're not going to end up with a bunch of money. We're not going to end up with, hallelujah, with things that we really want. Amen. We're going to end up with things that we need, Amen. church. And I find out some of that ain't good enough for us. <laughs> Getting what we need. Because we like what we want. Ain't that right? Is that right? That's the truth. Me and Junior, Junior's already in school since I'm about to go back to school to get my heat and air degree. Is that going to do me any good? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not going to be able to say once I graduate, I can get a job just like that. But what I do know, church, even if I don't have a job then, I still know who my God is. Amen. And I won't bring that trouble into the church house. Amen. Why? Because I believe in God. And Amen. sin Amen. will not hinder me from serving and worshiping God. Amen. Come on. So I don't know this. Well, what's important to us? I think Billy's job getting a little slow. Furniture ain't doing too good, Charlie. Is that what you depend on? You know what butters your brain? <laughs> we ain't got no bread to be butter, Junior. <laughs> Brother Cole, you got any butter? All gone. <laughs> Kevin, I ain't got much bread to be butter. But I know this one thing, church. I'm not fretting about nothing, Tina. Come on, My worries that I see, they try to get upon me, I don't bring them into the church house. Why? Because that hinders the body. Hallelujah. That hinders us worshiping the God. Because you have to understand the body. We are a body, church. Yes. And if one ain't doing something, it hinders the whole body. Yes, it does. It hinders us. It hinders all of us. Lisa, when you, I'm just, you need an example. Uh-oh. Or Nikki, let's use Nikki. Well, I'll say she said it close to Nikki. <laughs> I tell Nikki I get about 90% of my messages right away. <laughs> Make sure I get around her so I can see what she's saying. What kind of message I'm going But if we come into the church house and Lisa's not doing that, that's a, that's a hindrance in the body. Because if we're all up standing, praise of God, we live I'm telling you, tell you what the service we have. We don't have, we don't have these services because it's your fault. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hmm? Amen. It's the church. Junior. I don't mean to say it in a bad way, but it's your fault. I don't mean that in a bad way. I'm being honest with you. It's your fault. Clifton? It's your fault. My fault. Tony. It's your fault. <laughs> it's our fault. Amen. Yes, it is. We've let sin just back. creep on in here and just hinder God's what God's going to do for us. Arguing, fussing, mad at each other. You know what I'm finding out, church? The, listen, listen, I want you to listen to me. The devil's trying his best right now, Tina, to get family separated. Yes, he is. You understand me? Dennis, the devil right now, if he can get the family, if he can get the family quarreling and fighting and get that wedge between them, guess what will happen? There'll be, hallelujah, hallelujah, there'll be trouble in the church. But I'm telling you, church, 
fucking notice this thing. Know what the devil's doing. Get rid of that thing. Get this family, get unity back together. Hey, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey, 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 hallelujah. Hey,